Hi all, Terhi here. Uh, today I'm doing a layout with lots and lots of uh, exclusive uh, ephemeras from HipKit Club. Um, I'm really in love with this July exclusive pack because we had so many words. This was actually called the words Epomera pack or something. Anyway, uh, there was this little frame and some bigger words and lots of smaller words and I decided to focus on the words so I'm not doing any any huge paper layers like I used to do but instead I'm I'm doing a lot of little words here and there and that how to create this layout. Also I'm not adding any lots of mixed media but some because I still want to keep the focus on the right place. So what I'm actually doing is that I added a lot of uh, 3D foam behind all the Epamera pieces I'm going to use. Um, this is really easy way to add the Epameras to the right place to your page because you don't have to play with glue or uh, any other uh, how to say it <laughs> um, messy things so uh, I just added one piece of paper this was uh, from Pink Paisley uh, Page Evans collection and it's quite neutral so I thought it would be nice for the background uh, then I'm playing with some paint from the color kit. I'm just spreading some to get some color uh, and using my finger to spread it because I don't want any big amount it and your finger is just the right way to add it. I'm also adding some yellow. This is from Shimmers. Uh, it's a nice liquid paint and a nice way to add some, some brighter areas for the page. Now the rest of doing this layout is uh, to doing a collage of all these Epamera, all these uh, chipboard stickers and all of kind I'm wa wanting to use. So I'm uh, going with step by step adding one piece at a time to this layout to make it um, look good. Uh, one of the rules I have in my mind is that when I have these um, words with red background, I don't want them to be next to each other. I want them to be one here, one there, and one in the other side. Um, and the same goes with every color, because I want it to be kind of a balanced collage thing at the end. So it takes some time to think where to put them all. Some are... <laughs> easier to put but uh, these red ones give me some some challenges but <laughs> I did it and I'm very proud of myself to use the red red the items at especially this uh, red frame because red is kind of challenged color for me um, I, I like red but it's really hard to use on layout for me, so I'm really proud of myself. I used the frame. Uh, these chipboards are stickers and they are from Becky Higgins, so these are really nice and flat chipboards. And as said, I add some 3D forms uh, behind the Epamera because I want them to pop up. Uh, I'm finishing the layout with adding some black hearts. Uh, I'm choosing black because I want to have some contrast and as I have this black and white picture I want to have something black on the page too. So I'm um, using uh, coloring mist from the color kit from July and I um, also add some black mist drops. So that was it. Lots of words and lots of everything, but still I have this balanced layout. Thank you for watching and bye!